Security here is state-of-the-art, quite impenetrable. Unless, of course, you flew a drone through the window, one of Mary's mouth breathers left open. The recording device is in her security room. Getting there should be a simple matter of navigating the vents. What the hell? She's using these people as house servants, against their will. Horrible in itself, but a million times worse knowing they end up as unwilling organ donors. You have a real fucking attitude problem, do you know that? Please, I need help. <laughs> Idiot. Do you piss everyone off the way you're pissing me off, you wanker? <laughs> Stupid git. See what kind of recording we've got on her. Just look at this place. This is what comes of old crooked money. The Kelly family has been profiting from people's misery for a long time. She's got this shit all over the manor. So you've been in there before? Is that how you ended up in the basement of the Southwark incinerator? We needed something incriminating. So we decided someone had to get in here and plant a bug. I wasn't going to assign someone else to do that. You saw how Mary uses the people she grabs out of the EPC. And the staff's uniform's not hard to mimic, so I went in. What I didn't know was that she had intel on our investigation. My team. I thought going off book would stop the leaks, but she still knew we were coming. She tortured me for the names of my team. Tried to break me, but cops don't give up cops. Turned out she already knew the whole unit and put hits out on them. <laughs> the woman is a mind fucker. On the bright side, she didn't bind you with one of her microchips. She probably knew you'd have killed yourself before obeying her. That's how I ended up on that butcher's table. So many reasons to want to rid the world of her, but it wouldn't be enough to just put one in her brain. My mates died trying to bring her to justice. I have to honor that. everything I've done for you. You made me a slave. All of us. Please, let me go. Take this thing out. Back to your old life. Back to nothing. Back to you. 2.5 screaming blighters in your dead end job and sucking off the dough. You don't want that, love. This microchip is scary, I know, but I've got to keep tracks on my merchandise, don't I? And this kitchen knife, that won't do it, love. Cutting yourself affects my bottom line. You mug. I can't live like this anymore. No. You are right there. It's all right, sweetheart, because I have another use for you. Good, 
be sure and spread the word. You know where this one goes. Get these two and all the others over to the venue and ready for the sale. Right away, ma'am. Also, the foreign investors have already landed and the drones are programmed, ready to deliver the invitations and the coordinates to all the guests. Mm, is that initiative I'm smelling, Peter? Initiative can be a dangerous thing. Can be misinterpreted. get her hands on this kind of tech. It takes a sick mind to come up with killer microchips. Perhaps a diseased mind, but definitely an ingenious one. Perfect psych profile for a group like Zero Day, wouldn't you say? Her affiliations aren't my priority, Bagley. She's keeping these people enslaved. And it sounds as if she's selling them. This is huge. She's using the implanted chip as a control mechanism, a deterrent to disobedience. Step out of line and she sells your organs instead. Deadsec, we'll have to crash that slave auction. Get all the information we can out of there. The location will be on the invitations. She hasn't sent out the invitation yet, but when she does... Bagley, monitor the drone networks. Give us a heads up when Mary sends out her fleet. Until then, I reckon we're in a holding pattern. I'll get in touch if I hear about anything else that might interest you. Cheers, Deadsec. I'm getting the hang of fighting for DedSec, yeah? You wouldn't have been recruited if DedSec thought you'd be killed that easily. What are you trying to say, Bagley? I appreciate Bagley's to-the-point nature. I'm sure you'll get used to it yourself. Since we're waiting for our cordial invitation to Mary Kelly's tasteless theme party, we can finally get back to what really matters, solving the mystery of Zero Day. Who are they, and why did they frame DedSec for the bombings? What do we have, Bags? Glad you asked. Today, the great AI detective has two leads for his dog's body politic. Obviously, Albion needs looking into, but I also have a more unusual thread for you to pull on. There's a new hacktivist group on the dark web scene called the 404. But instead of being in it for the lulls, this lot seems to be in it for the brutal reshaping of society by any means necessary. Sound like anyone you know? I've got options, then. I've marked both on your optic. anything important you've been activated no problem I've been monitoring the drone network Mary Kelly has finally sent out the invitations to her slave market sale. Deadsec, it's Caitlin Lau. This is your specialty. Hack one of those drones and get the location where she's selling those poor microchipped people. Let's put an end to this. Well, that was simple, even for you. Give me a moment to decipher the security codes. So, Bagley, what do you have? Mary Kelly is holding her sale at Hackney Baths. Opened in 1904, it was, as the name implies, a public sanitation facility. In today's more enlightened modern times, it's a slave trading market. She mentioned foreign investors, so this is big. It means associates, clients, employees, anyone remotely involved in her organization. We're taking Mary Kelly down from within. Inspector Lau wants to take her case against Mary Kelly to a contact in the Attorney General's office, which means gathering as much data as we can to make sure it has the leverage needed for them to prosecute. The microchips are a huge part of this equation that we know almost nothing about. We need something tangible about these things. See if you can find anything. Blueprints, receipts, samples. So, the plan is simple. Crash the Kelly's soiree, find out as much as you can, and, minor detail, try not to get killed. Can't be too careful at the bath team. 
Mary can kill all her captives with the push of a button. If we try to free them now, their good is dead. She doesn't know we're on to her yet. That gives us the advantage. Okay, you know what you want? Just yes. send it over to me. I have access to the system. Get all the names, places, dates, whatever information you can in there. We need to build this case. And find a way to free those people. I'll see what I can find. Aye, no one's here yet. Good thing, too. The champagne's late. You know how these rich bastards are like free blanc. We end up a team with it. Yeah, products primed and ready for sale. No worries. Nah, shit. Not for this lot, at least, which is fine with me. She's the boss of... Come on, look at the camera. Straight. Right, that's good. Stand up now, and slowly turn around. I, I, I don't want to do this, please. Get your fucking ass up. Fucking miserable. There's no way this bastard will sell. The buyers expect high quality stuff. All right then, get him downstairs. We'll update the catalogue and put his stats no, online. No, I'm sorry. I'll do what you say. <gasps> Don't take me there, no! Shut the fuck up! Damn. Fucking what? Time to investigate. Chances are good the basement will be locked. Chances are equally good that one of these knobheads left their access codes laying around somewhere. Thanks for the cellar key, knobhead. Fantastic.
Recently, it's just the most wholesome night out. Darling, let's go and have some bubbly and maybe buy ourselves a servant. This is fucking sickening. Keep your head. If we try anything before disabling the microchips, Mary Kelly is liable to purge her inventory. Well, there it is, the golden goose. Mary Kelly set up a fucking online marketplace for, for the darkest shit imaginable. Human trafficking, black market organs, guns. These people have to be stopped. I suggest washing your hands after this. Well, here's something interesting. Miss Kelly, why is our explosive shipment delayed? You proceed with crypto. Every penny, love. Must admit, I thought you were some trolls chatting shit in Mum's basement. And what do you think now? I think you're well funded. And my organisation could be implicated in something quite ghastly. I think the price just doubled. True to your reputation. <laughs> but we can offer you something more valuable than money. <laughs> What's that then? Power. We can make you the Queen of London. Queen, eh? A queen is sovereign, autonomous. Unchecked. Release our shipment, and London will be yours to rule. Well, I know a good deal when I hear one. Fireworks are on the way. Careful you don't burn yourselves now. Uh, this is the nail in her coffin. Mary Kelly supplied the explosives for the bombings. Add that to the slaves and the organ market. She is done. That's an interesting turn of events. So Mary isn't Zero Day, but she's involved. I have to admit, Zero Day's plan to cover their tracks was clever, and it worked. Even I didn't suspect this, and I suspect a lot of things. Let's not lose sight of what we're doing here. We need everything on the Golden Goose for Caitlin's case. Bagley, were you able to recover any data? This is a simple market site. I've recovered inventory lists, but not much that will help Inspector Lau's case. Baggy, we need to find their server and get the info Caitlin needs. Then we can shutter the horror show for good. I'd love to, but the servers are rudely jumping all over the world. They're probably using a shuffle protocol and some kind of mixnet. I can work it out, obviously, but it will take me a few days. The guy upstairs who welcomed everyone seems to be running a show. Might save us some time.
instincts. I've got coordinates for the Golden Goose servers and an abundance of microchip control relay. Both are at Neogate. Oh, fucking nice one, Bagley. This is bad. Dead sec. We need that server data. Once we have it, I'll take it to the Attorney General's office. Mary Kelly is going down for all of this. If you think we're gonna leave the servers intact, you're having a laugh. Same goes for the microchip control relay. Let's shut them down and save everyone that's been chipped. Next stop, Neogate. It seems Mary hit the Golden Goose service in the heart of a cybersecurity software company. I don't condone her actions, but I must applaud the method. I think I'm finally getting the hang of this whole resistance fighter thing. You wouldn't have been recruited if DedSec thought you'd be killed that easily. I'll take that as a compliment, I guess. Don't let Bagley get under your skin. Job well done. Huh? What? Don't judge. Don't judge. Are you shitting me? I'll take that. Contacted by our potential recruit. Patching them through now. If you want my help ever, you only have to ask. Just join right. us, will ya? We need them. people like you. What do you say? Okay, no, yes, let's do it. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm here. Neogate hasn't been around for long, but they're leading the antivirus market. I bet the Kellys have something to do with this growing success. Regardless, we're about to destroy all of it. 
Listen, I want that as bad as you do. But let's gather all the evidence we can before blowing it up. This is what we've been chasing after this whole time. I suggest hacking the camera network to see what's what. Hello, this is Roger Morris from Neo. Will you pipe down over there? Well, I'm trying to record something. Yeah, yeah, I'm making this audio log if ever the true activities that are occurring in this building should ever come to light. Many of us here have noticed a flurry of subtle, well-planned, but nonetheless suspicious activity that occurs here week after week. There's also little to no communication between us and management. This week, we noticed some rather large shipments being funneled through the canal from Battlebridge right into the building. Curiously got a better of me, so I discreetly opened one of the packages while making its way inside to discover computer parts. But no one in shipments received any record of anything new being brought in recently. I shall continue investigating while I hope my worst fears about what's really going on here are not true. Neogate, audio log, number 147. The date is November the 4th, 2023. We received a shipment last week of what is said to be the latest technological advancements in solar panels. What's really of note is the overwhelming amount of energy they're capable of generating. I'm still not entirely sure what they are for or their purpose, but I have an idea. There have been rumors circulating about some of the activities going on in the building, but our superiors discourage any questions. I don't believe These feeds are from a sub-basement under the server room. Anyone up for some light entertainment? You see, it contains a chemical cocktail. Botulinum, conotoxin, succinicolene. Well, why go into specifics if you wouldn't even understand? Let's just say it took a lot of trial and error to get the mix right. Wouldn't want to kill too quickly or contaminate the organs. Oh my god, this is where they implant the microchips. Test them. Bagley, capture all this footage. It's all going into my case file. Here's another. I'm glad to see they're trying to keep things sterile. Don't want to risk infection. One more. At issue are the strong convulsions triggered by the microchips and concern over the possibility of damaging the valuable merchandise, the eyes being the most vulnerable. Initial findings indicate that the microcharge may be the problem. Although the damage to the lower stem is minimal, it is enough to trigger strong convulsions in approximately 34% of cases. All right, Bagley, let's move along. I can't take this. There's a special place in hell for all the people involved in this operation. You've got all the Golden Goose data along with this footage. Plus, you have her conspiring in the bombings. That must be enough to put Mary away. I hope so. Now, how about blowing that shit up and disabling those microchips? Brilliant. Time to put Mary Kelly's operation on ice. Let's blow some stuff up.
It should do it. The microchips are no longer functioning. I think Kenny's golden goose is cooked. Ever get a sense I don't appreciate your comedy? Just leave the area before the same thing happens to you, all right? We haven't enough, dead sec. I'm going to my contact in the Attorney General's office right now. No time to waste. Mary Kelly is finally going down. Thanks. Don't let us down, Caitlin. That's good for Caitlin, but shouldn't we do something about all the people that still have chips in them? Any second now, Mary Kelly is going to realize that her personal slaves are no longer slaves and more like potential witnesses. We should apprehend her before she turns them into definite corpses. We can't risk that happening. It might throw a spanner in Caitlin's plans. But we need to help those last few people she's threatening. The Kelly stronghold is at the Sandstone residence. I've marked it on your map. Mary's possibly going on a rampage of cleaning house, and she still has control over the microchips in her vicinity. We need to disable them from her security system, if we don't want all the help to die. Right. They're well trained, you see. Not like people. 
people are lazy, aren't they? Won't do what they're told. And don't turn your back on them. They'll try to fuck you. Being selfish, that's what they are. But dogs... Dogs just obey orders. They don't have hidden agendas. No ulterior motives. They just live for you. Loyal till the end. Simple enough, if you ask me. But still too much to ask of people. Of all this useless bunch, dogs are the only ones I really trust. That's dumb. Check this out. Come on, scum! Fuck me. Right. Well, at least the chips are disabled. Mary has sealed herself in her office downstairs, but the mainframe will repower the elevator. Oh, and guards are on the lookout, so do try to survive. Oh, brilliant. to stay near the mainframe long enough so I can reactivate the lift to Mary's office. Bloody chips don't work. I'm in my office. Come exterminate the vermin.
visitors down. Get your useless asses down here and end these cockroaches. Come and check this out. The elevators are operational and you can access Mary's office now. And Inspector Lau is on channel. None too happy, I'm afraid. DedSec, what the hell are you doing over there? We had a deal. We do this my way. That's why we gathered all that proof. I have the paperwork we need. Is your paperwork going to stop her killing her slaves? The woman's a mad dog, Lau. We don't have time to fucking discuss this again. Get in there and stop her from doing anything drastic. I'm on my way. Come on then, I don't need no fucking microchip to gut you filthy bastards! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? At least your timing's good. The mate's coming to take you in. Oh, I am counting on it, love. Everyone freeze! Back away from her. Mary Kelly, you're under arrest. Take me in, Inspector. I'll throw myself on the mercy of the bleeding court. But don't plan on me staying around very long. You lot! I gave you purpose when this city spit you out! We'll be seeing each other again very soon. Stop! You don't think she's gonna let you scum take her white whale? What are you protecting? The system or the people? Promise us. Promise us. She won't go free.
Go. I'll take care of this. It's like you got your wish. Mary won't be walking away from this or anything else. I wanted to do this the right way, but after everything I've seen, I... Uh, I guess I couldn't let her live. She had it coming, Lau. And it's all she deserved. For the life she destroyed. For Angel. You did the right thing. The people have spoken. If Mary Kelly was a saint, she wouldn't have been murdered by her own people. I don't know. That was some version of justice, but not mine. At least, I didn't think it was when we started all of this. Well, the Queen may be dead, but there are plenty of Clan Kelly peons willing to take up the mantle. You're right about that, Bagley. I will keep my ear to the ground. I hear about more Clan Kelly shenanigans, you'll be the first to know. You're good partners, Densek. Let's keep it going. <laughs> 